Check this view out. Wow. You have a boxing? Oh! Look at this. I've never seen a condo with this, Kirk. Holy moly. Condo rentals in the big city of Bangkok have changed a lot. Man, the last couple of years, because of you know what, there's been so many condos available, so many people getting great deals. But lately I've had a lot of friends tell me that prices are going up, availability is a little bit tougher. So I thought it'd be a great opportunity to tour you guys through three different condos in three different neighborhoods and see what it's like today. Okay, and to show us through the units today, I got some special guests. I think I see them right over here. How's it going, guys? Pretty good. What's your name? Hi, Mabang. And I'm Kirk. Kirk and Maprong, I was going to say nice to meet you guys, but I, I can't lie to these guys. The truth is, I know them very well. Kirk, where are we? What are we looking at? We are in Petbury. Right here is the MRT station, and we're going to the address, this building right here. Man, as we're walking in this place, it's like a giant jungle with a waterfall in the middle of the city. First impression, pretty great. This place is pretty nice, man. Let's start off by just telling them all the key stats. It's a two bedroom, two bath, 76 square meters, which is about 820 square feet. And uh, it's available on a 12 month uh, lease. Yeah, this place is super modern, super nice. It's one of those um, smallish, but not too small, ultra modern condos. So Kirk, I'd love to tour them through, but you said it's fully furnished. So fully furnished in this case, is all the appliances. You have your stove, you have a microwave, you have a refrigerator, and you even have a washing machine. But it doesn't come with things like cooking utensils or plates, dishes, things like that. It's an open concept. So your dining room, your kitchen, and your living room are the same room. You gotta love the views out here, eh? Right here is the MRT station, which gives you the underground subway. You can take that to get to most parts of the city, or you can take it to a BTS stop, which is the SkyTrain. And that way you can connect to almost the entire uh, city. So this is the Makassan uh, Airport Rail Link. You can take that and for like 40 baht from here, get all the way to Suwannapoom Airport. Bangkok's a great base, eh, to jump around, whether it's within Thailand or over to Vietnam and stuff. And this has got you a half hour from Suwannapoom for, for a buck. You can't beat that. You really can't. So as we're coming back inside Kirk TV, I could Netflix and chill down there. Absolutely. So let's go into the first bedroom here. This is bedroom number one. So in here you have your bed, your large screen TV facing out to this amazing view. It's almost a 180 view. And even down here, you have a really nice green space. Oh, so yeah, you're not you, just looking at buildings. You don't often see that from a condo in Bangkok. Wow. That view is incredible. Well, you have your closet here on the left. Oh, plenty little, of closet space. A little vanity area. Oh, nice. And then you have a full sunken tub, separate shower, with some amazing marble pieces. Let me just interrupt that tour and show you some of the amenities. I got to jump over these little stepping stones, but I'm here at the swimming pool. Check this out. Giant swimming pool, all with amazing landscaping. It's humid today in Bangkok, so uh, if, if I was living here, you'd probably catch me right here chilling by the pool. They also have an amazing gym, and they actually have a second pool up on the 44th floor. This is the ninth floor, but this building's 44 stories tall, and there is that other pool up there. So that's some of the amenities. One of the best things about living in Bangkok. Now, for the, for the moment you've been waiting for, let's go back and see if Kirk will tell us how much it costs. It's 50,000 baht, which is about $1,400 US. That includes a swimming pool, a fitness gym, a co-working space. And actually, this particular building provides free uh, maid service every two months. Free maid service? Not bad. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna make a mess for two months. <laughs> nice. All right, should we go check out the next place? Let's do it. 
we've been offered a ride to the next location. I've never seen a car like this. What is this? Um, it's a Aura oh, Good Cat. It's an electric car here. A fully electric car, Aura? Yeah, fully electric. Oh, wow. What's your name? Uh, my name is Pon. Yeah, Pon uh, is uh, the guy who showed us into this place. He's good friends with the owner? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, and he told me that the bed inside, extra comfortable. Oh, it's very comfortable. It's like um, 50 grand for the bed alone. A 50,000 baht bed. If you uh, are out there and looking to rent, then this place is uh, is well worth it. So Pon is offered to drive us to the next spot. Let's zip away in your electric car, man. Sure, let's go. Kirk, maybe uh, you can tell everyone a little bit more. You were just telling me something about kind of how you're you're living the dream that a lot of people out there watching this video are probably thinking of living. What's the deal? Tell them a bit of your story. Sure. So I'm part of the retired working for you community. I, this is almost uh, I've been a, a follower since the very beginning, and so I'm like all you guys. In 2007, I came here with some friends, and uh, didn't have many uh, expectations about Thailand. Didn't know anything about it really and I just fell in love with the country and so uh, the more time I spend here early in those days I realized I could retire here say 15 years of working and still maintain the same uh, standard of living so that was the plan. Kirk was the first guy that that I called when I decided to move to Thailand. I, we have a mutual Thai friend in LA, Tammy. Shout out Tammy. A few months ago, we hatched an idea of how he could share that dream with all of you. But let's let's save that. Let's just get to this next spot. Sounds good. Okay, as we get out of the funk mobile. Kirk, where are we here, man? This place looks nice. So we're at the uh, Park 24 in Prom Pong District. It's an amazing building. Swandi Kap. How are you? Hey. Hey, how's What's it going? Your, good. What's your name? I'm Joel. And you watch the channel? Yeah, I do. Oh. Since, I think, 7,000 subscribers. Whoa, yeah. we got an early one here. And yeah. you live here? Yeah, yeah, I live in the Tower 3 here. Oh, really? Yeah. How awesome is it? Awesome place. Yeah. yeah? It's really good. Nice. Yeah. Well, great to meet you, man. Yeah, yeah. Keep up the good work. Thanks, Bye. brother. All right. Oh, wow. First impressions of this unit is really nice, man. Kirk, before I show them the rest of it, though, tell us the key stats here. This condo is a two bedroom, one bath, 56 square meters, which is like 600 square feet. It comes fully furnished with all these appliances. So definitely more stuff here than the last one. Toasters, kettles. This is what we were talking about at the last unit. Kirk, I'm going to do a loop. And okay. when I come back, you can tell them how much it costs. Yeah. We found them again. All right, Kirk, how much for this place? So this unit is going to cost you 55,000 baht, which is about $1,500 US, but you get amenities galore. Holy cow, my prong. Yeah. This is crazy. Have you ever seen something like this in a condo? Oh, I think it's, it's actually in here. It's really amazing. It, you have a boxing, you have a sauna, you have finished. Oh, it's everything. Do you do boxing? Yes. You do? Yeah. Can you can you kick the heavy bag? Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Okay, don't look at this. Oh, look at my prong. This is what happens. My prong, by the way, is the newest member of the retired working for you real estate team. That's what she's gonna do to you if you don't rent a condo from her. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. you. Look at this. I've never seen a condo with this, Kirk. It's amazing, right? Holy moly. He wasn't kidding. You really get to work out. Amenities galore. You, you, you promised it, man. Look at this. And then over here, you got an absolutely massive gym with that crazy Bangkok skyline. Really, really, this place is something else. This is a library and a co-working space. So just a common space that people can uh, come in and... Oh, we don't want to interrupt. There's actually someone doing some co-working in here. Uh, everything about this building's incredible. Views out over the Chao Phaya now that we're up. Oh my God. 
Now that we're up at the swimming level, look at this pool. Kirk, this is wild, man. What do you think? Is this amazing or what? I want to move here. <laughs> 360 degree views of Bangkok. Absolutely. Look how big the pool is behind Kirk. We're about 800 meters from the BTS stop. And Phong Pong is kind of the Beverly Hills of Bangkok. It's high luxury, uh, high-end shopping, and dining. It's this amazing area. What is this? So this is a this facial is recognition yeah. uh, scanner and also a finger uh, fingerprint. Hey there, how's it going? You're gonna be surprised that the technology here, the amenities here, everything really just, especially in the newer buildings, blows away. We got one more to look at, and then I'm gonna tell you how uh, we're, we're setting something up here with Kirk and McPrang to help you guys get over here and live your dream. We've got from the electric car back to Bye. Bangkok taxi. Okay, so now we're in Silom. So the Silom area is the financial heart of Bangkok. And there's a lot going on down here. We're literally a stone's throw away from where number one in my, my series was, where Mark Weens took me for lunch. So, so there is some amazing local Thai stuff in this area as well. Oh, Maprong, is this is our place? Yes. So underneath us, this little walkway, there's actually some seating and a couple fountains and a sitting area outdoors. So we've just come inside and this place is spectacular. Like, man, I think this might be the nicest one yet, Kurt. I think you're right. It's amazing already. Just that first the lobby, just the lobby. Maprang, what floor are we going to? Uh, 27. Okay, Kirk, third and final unit. Tell me the key stats. You know what? Let me take you to the main event first. I gotta show this to you. Ooh, nice kitchen. Check this view out. Whoa, it's like a split level. It's awesome. You get a sunken living room here, dining room, with a view of the skyline of Silom and the famous Mahanakon Tower. Whoa, look at that. Oh, I can see the sky train. It's incredible. Okay, so this condo is a two bedroom, two bath, fully furnished unit. Uh, it's 87 square meters or 936 square feet. So that's the biggest it, one we've seen today? It is, and it's the, uh, the, most, the highest luxury uh, building that we've seen also. And it comes fully furnished? Completely furnished, includes uh, dishes, cups, everything you see here, all the appliances. All right, yeah, this is a unique layout compared to anything I've seen. Can we take a look around? Let's go. One more look at the view first, Kirk. It goes in all directions. We're only 480 meters from the uh, BTS, Chong Non Si station. So it's really close, you can get anywhere. Big modern kitchen here. If you've come to Thailand, you're gonna find all these mini, almost college refrigerators, kegerators. But uh, this is a full size kitchen. Has everything, four burners, the hot pot, the washer and dryer, single unit. European style. Absolutely. Oh yeah, this stuff is like, you got the old smeg. So we got living and dining, kitchen, Come around the corner here. This is bedroom number two. Ooh, nice little work area. I could uh, do my editing in there. We have a nice modern second bathroom and this is the master, Kirk? This is the master. Check out this view. Oh, I mean, I Sunrises could... with this view is pretty amazing. So it comes with uh, all the furnishings, like I said before, uh, blankets, pillows, just bring your luggage. You know you're in Bangkok when you wake up every day and pull the curtains. Good morning, Chris. Oh, good morning, darling. Oh, look at that. Haley, check this out. Draw the other side of the curtains, please. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Haley, look at your view. Haley, look at this. Wake up in the morning, wiggle your toes. And that's literally the view from your bed. Yeah, that's cool. I love doing these tours, man. Yeah. This is a lot of fun to see what's out here. Um, I would say that things are still looking pretty good. I thought it would be worse than it is when, when we started today, but there's some, there's some nice stuff out here, Kirk. There's a lot of variety. Availability is getting a little tougher, and the prices are going up a little bit. 
but you can still, if you have uh, some good agents or some good friends to help you out, uh, you can still find good deals and uh, cater to exactly what you're looking for. We've started the amenities tour. This is uh, near the top. They got a pool, but I've heard that there's a bigger pool even higher up. So let's go there. Mm. Wow. Yeah, a lot of common workspaces in here. Oh, hey. Hello. What's How's up? it going? All good, thanks. So we just met a German subscriber. What's your name? Philippe. I'm Italian, but I live in Germany. And uh, yeah, great to meet you. And great you, to you meet think you this is a good building to live? It's very nice, but it's a bit expensive compared to what you can get in Bangkok. Oh, really? But you have a lot of nice amenities, nice situation all around the zone. All right, cool. Yeah, I'm about to tell them how much it costs. So amenities, they got the gym behind me. Spectacular gym, actually. Everything here is spectacular. This is like a, a massive kind of hot tub, public jacuzzi type of thing. So what do they have to pay for this unit? It is 79,000 baht per month, which is about 2,200 US dollars. That's not that bad of a price for what I'm used to paying. But the big news here is that Kirk and Maprang are actually here for you guys. This is the Bangkok new version, retired working for you real estate Maprang. How do you feel to be on the team? Oh, I believe fantastic feeling yeah and i want you to come with us to enjoy in thailand look at this city there's plenty of room for everyone including one of my best buddies kirk kirk we've been knowing each other for years man and we've been dreaming about this how does it feel day one of doing this real estate thing together it's amazing honestly it's a dream come true we've talked about it for a while uh, you know how much I love Thailand, I know how much you love Thailand, and how much we want to share Thailand with people. Introduce you to, uh, to this great country and this amazing city of Bangkok. Whatever you need, uh, if you want information about how much it would cost, what areas you should be looking at, uh, just reach out to yeah. me and Maprong. We can take care of you, but uh, we really hope to see you here in Bangkok soon. Awesome, guys. This is beyond yeah. exciting. And let me just talk to them for a bit. So RWFU Real Estate, Bangkok office, now opened up. And it's got Kirk, guy with a lifetime of real estate experience over in California, and Maprong, ambitious young Thai go-getter, the dream team to help you find what you want, whether you're looking to buy or rent. We have had so many people write us over the last couple of years asking for this exact help, so this is why we're doing it. We're really just here for you, so that in a sea of real estate as far as the eye can see, you know that you'll have someone who you can trust, um, looking out for your best interest and trying to find your dream place so that you can uh, be living the same dream that Kirk and I are lucky enough to be living. Reach out, your first point of contact will be Adam, nephew Adam's gonna, gonna suss it out, see what you guys are looking for. And then uh, if you're looking in Bangkok, you get handed off to Kirk and Maprang. Down in Samui, we got Andrew, we got Chiang Mai coming soon. So uh, we're just here to help people live their Thailand dreams. Cheers, everyone.